people living with disabilities, especially the hearing impaired, in Nigeria most times feel unloved and left out. And these are the times like this that the country is joining the rest of the world to mark the International Day of Sign Language. It is to raise awareness to all, especially to those who can hear. Whether or not you can hear, we all can walk hand in hand to promote the recognition of our right to use sign languages in the society. Plus TV Africa's Ngozi Ikao HAC reports. According to the World Federation of the Deaf, there are more than 70 million deaf people worldwide. In Nigeria, 25.5 million are living with disabilities, out of which 9.5 million are deaf. This year, the World Federation of the Deaf declares the theme as we sign for human rights. Tawakaut Babatunde is a sign language interpreter at the Ikeja Junior High School, Lagos. We still have a little bit challenge. At times, you have to explain, keep up, because they learn slowly. Explain. You use practical and um, demo, you demonstrate, you use real life something for them in order for them to understand because they learn by what they see, not by what they hear. It's a thing of joy when I, when I sign and they understand me, they know what I'm saying and it's just a joy for me that I'm, I too I impact in the life of um, special children and disabilities. We need government to employ more people so that in offices, in hospitals, in everywhere, in, even in banks, in banks, in everywhere, every organization, we need them. Most television stations in Nigeria don't use sign language to communicate to the hearing impaired persons. Lainka Adagon, a veteran broadcaster, explains why and what can be done. Why most policies are generated because of the added cost of hiring a translator, the sign language translator. Maybe the, the um, various uh, non governmental organizations promoting the rights of uh, the, the physical challenge can take it up from there and uh, make this uh, organization to employ those who will be using uh, or promote sign language in their daily broadcasts. Do people really understand what sign language is? A means of uh, communicating without uh, saying words, more or less uh, non-verbal communication. I've been with um, Deaf and Dumb before and at least I understand few of their movement and action and telling you that I want this or this is what I don't like or how they behave if they say I love you. When you motion to somebody to come or go or bye-bye or I can hear you. As today marks a day to raise awareness on the importance of sign language, having any kind of disability doesn't mean you don't have the same right like every other person. And you can definitely be part of conversations in the society. For Plus TV Africa, Ngozika Ohai Chesi. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.